Hey guys, Zephanix here. Now this one goes out to King Human. What's going on, man? Um, I figured out, you know, I do a representation. You know, you know how you know you do, you know, you know, you know, you're the bald white guy, you know, with the black background. You know, right now the bald black guy with the white background, both got the glass. No, no, not not even look. No. Okay, so let's go on. Now you, you guys gotta excuse me. Cause I'm gonna ramble because there's no way that I can possibly put all of this into any form of perspective whatsoever. Basically, King Human is leaving YouTube. Now, a lot of you guys don't know who King Human is, and you know, I pity you. I advise you to go ahead to this man's um, YouTube page and just check out all his YouTube um, check out all his videos. He has a lot of good videos. He's an outside-the-box thinker, and that's one of the things I like about him. I mean, he totally thinks outside the box. Then let me give you an example. Um, I owe a lot to King Human because there is, I was in a financial bind a while ago, and a lot of you guys know the financial bind. I try to keep, you know, while I do try to keep my, um, my life, you know, somewhat private, I try to portray my life, you know, online so people won't make the same mistakes I do. Now, a lot of people take it, uh, take it as different things, but whatever's whatever. You know, if you take it that way, then obviously the video wasn't for you. But, what I happened was is that I went ahead and um, I was in a financial bind. I didn't know really what to do. You know, I've sold pretty much everything and anything I can possibly sell. I didn't know what to do. So one day I was browsing on YouTube, you know, and um, I actually ran across King Human's web page, um, his King Human's YouTube page. So I started watching his videos. I'm like, okay. Kept watching him, kept watching him, and one particular video came to mind. He made this video where um, he was actually talking about selling like a big old pallet of electronic equipment for a certain amount of money, and then turning around and selling it on eBay or, or some online source. So I decided that you know, you know what, that sounds like a good idea. So I'm going to do that. So that's what I did. I took that, I turned it around, I sold it on eBay. Um, the pallet was, and I don't remember the exact price of the pallet, but let me give you an example. Say the pallet was about $100, right? I turned it around and sold about, okay, we'll probably, let me, let me guys give you a little more uh, picture of it. It was about $100 and mm, the pallet, let me see, the pallet was $100. And I sold, I think I sold them about like $25, $35 a pop. And the pallet, I mean, we're talking about a huge pallet of wrapped up, Electronic equipment here, and I'm not computers, but you know, yeah, actually, I think some of them are computers too. Long and short of it, by selling about four or five things, I was already turning profit. So I made a lot of money just by sitting down and listening to this man. And you know, I owe a lot to him. So it's really sad for me to see him leaving YouTube, you know. And I understand his, his, reason, his reason for leaving completely. And it's kind of the reason why, you know, I venture, you know, very soon to actually leave YouTube too. I mean, not because of, you know, well, his reasons because, of, you know, YouTube has changed since we originally started. It was, it started off as, you know, people blogging. We blogged about our, what we loved, what we hated. A lot of us blogged about different things from everything from how you can make money to which is better, the PlayStation, you know, um, PlayStation 2 or the Xbox, you know, versus the GameCube at the, at the time. And there was so many things to do, but now YouTube has just become this corporate I don't even know what to say, you know? It, it went from a community website to sucking corporate dick. And I mean, that's just how, how it's going. And it, it's it's retardedly annoying. You know, it's just like, whatever happened to, I don't, whatever happened to YouTube, you know? I didn't realize it turned to them tube, you know? Apparently, I missed something. But anyway, um, King Human, you will be missed. You know, I know you said that you you leave on your trip and you might come back and you'll see how you feel when you might come back. You're heading to Vegas. I understand that. You know, Vegas is a big thing for you. You always head to Vegas all the time. So I just want to say that you know, it's definitely been an honor to have been able to learn from everything that you've taught me. You know, let's try that again. <laughs> you know, it's been an honor to watch your videos, man. I've learned a lot from your videos. And I definitely appreciate what you've done for me. You know, and the reality of it is, is that very soon I want to do the same exact thing. I want to go ahead, turn things around, and I want to start portraying, you know, kind of giving people advice on how to make money from home and do a lot a lot of things like that. I'm I've been doing it for so long now 
you know, not long, long, obviously, but I've been making money from home now that, you know, I'm ready to start sharing it with the world. So, you know, just like you did, you know, I mean, you didn't work from home, but you definitely, you know, shared your knowledge with the world. And I've learned from that knowledge. So I, do, I definitely do plan to do exactly the same thing that you do. Excuse me, my neck hurts a little bit. But like I said, it's been an honor, man. And I hope to see you again. You guys have a good night. Zeph out.